part of your assessment today, part of your well exam or your physical checkup will be doing, I'll be checking your cranial nerves, okay, from head to toe. I'm gonna focus on the 12 cranial nerves that we have, so I'm gonna be starting with that, and as I'm going down, I'm gonna have you step down from the bed because I'm gonna be checking your joints, your muscles, um, for any abnormalities that you might have or any pain or anything that you might have in between. Um, it's a little process that we're gonna be doing a back and forth, maybe um, you're lifting your hands, putting them down, your hands and your ankle, your feet, um, but we're just gonna be kind of going step by step and I'll be letting you know as I'm going through, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hands and these are my instruments that I'll be using. Several little different instruments for each cranial nerve that we need to test, okay? Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and start from the top and we're gonna start with your, with your head and your scalp and we're gonna be checking for um, your inspection of your shoulders and your neck. So we're gonna check different wounds. At this time also, we're gonna be checking your cranial nerve number one. But for right now, I'm gonna have you flex, I'm turn your head side to side, checking here, side to side, your flexion forward and back, forward and back. I think I'm gonna be positioning this side to make it easier so that they can go ahead and get in the camera. And I'm gonna have you tilt your head to the side to the shoulder and to the other side, okay? And as you're sitting there, I'm gonna give you two cotton balls. I'm gonna have you close your eyes and I'm gonna have you distinguish the sense of smell, okay? And it'll close your eyes and I'm gonna cover one nostril and you're gonna smell. Can you tell me what it is? Perfume. Perfect. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and give you another little sense of smell. And we're gonna see, you're gonna kind you're gonna also let me know what the smell is like. Okay, we're gonna cover one nostril or the other. I'm sorry. Bleach. Bleach. Okay, perfect. Which would that be cranial nerve number one, which is the olfactory nerve. That's the sense, it targets a sense of smell. Okay, as I'm going down, we're gonna I'm gonna check your TMJ, and right here, I'm gonna have you open your mouth, close, straight, straight, and I'm gonna have you open, kiss your teeth, hard, hard, hard. Okay, move your jaw, perfect. Okay, and then I'm gonna give you a little, uh, some water so that you can go ahead and swallow, and at this time, I'm gonna be checking also your swallowing, okay? We're gonna go ahead and sit you there. And as I'm checking here, we're gonna be checking for your joints here, okay? We're gonna be checking your muscle, your joints. Any, does it bother you? No. Checking your fingers, your phalanges, for any crepitus or any swelling on the joints, okay? Over here. Elbow on the mat, your wrist, and then we're checking your joints. Does it bother you? Does it hurt? No. Okay. No crepitus, no swelling, no other. Okay? You're going to go ahead and look forward. I'm going to go ahead and put my hand. I'm going to be checking your eye, which is the second cranial nerve, which is the optic to check for your eye, for your vision. Can you go ahead and read this for me? Or just my name? Can no, I am. Perfect, okay. Can you see this distance for me? Yes. Okay, can you read what it says there? Your child's teeth are important. Perfect, okay, which would, that would be the second cranial nerve. We're now gonna be doing the third cranial nerve, which is the ocular mole, okay? You're gonna go ahead and look straight. I'm gonna move my finger up and down and I want for you to follow with your eyes, okay? Just your eyes. Perfect. Cranial nerve number three is the ocular motor, which senses the mo movement of the eyes, okay? Now that cranial nerve number four, which is a trochlear, is gonna be up and down. You're gonna move your, up, your eyes up and down, okay? And then you're gonna look forward, and um, don't move, you're just gonna follow my finger, okay? It's gonna go in. Perfect, okay. Now we're gonna go into the, to the fifth cranial nerve, which is the trigeminal nerve, okay? I'm gonna have you touch the forehead. I'm gonna touch, I touch, 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 okay, perfect. Go 
ahead and look straight ahead and I'm gonna also check your eyes, okay? At this time for the light, for the restriction. Perfect, okay. Should be checking the sensation, the trigeminal. As, I, as you did your, the touching, I'm gonna also be doing and you're gonna tell me, you're gonna close your eyes and then you're gonna tell me where you feel the sensation, okay? Go ahead and close your eyes. My cheek. My other cheek. My forehead. My cheek. My arm. My other arm. Hell, perfect. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and do cranial nerve number six. The abdu abdu sense. Okay. You're going to look side to side. To the other side. Perfect. One more time. And one more time. Perfect. Okay. Okay, Mia, we're gonna go ahead and do now cranial, cranial nerve number eight, which is the acoustic, which is testing for the hearing, okay, and your equilibrium. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on the top and you're gonna hear, you're gonna let me know when you hear the sound. So you can raise your hand. Perfect, okay. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna do, we're gonna check the cranial nerve number nine, which is the glossal pharyngeal, which is the tongue. I'm gonna have you open your mouth and pick your tongue up and down, side and side, perfect, okay? Now cranial nerve number 10, which is uh, the vagus nerve. And in the vagus nerve, what we're checking is for uh, any responses with your tongue. Say, I'm gonna go ahead and, oops, my, Blade, you're gonna say ah. Uh, uh, you might have say ah. Uh, uh, okay. Now the gag reflex. I'm gonna put it a little bit further down, and you're gonna get a little reflex. Okay. okay. That's all I'm gonna do. Real quick. Say ah. Uh, ah. Uh, Perfect. Okay. And also, what we're gonna do is it checks for the ability to swallow. So I'm gonna have you swallow a little bit of water. Good. And as I'm doing that, I'm checking for her symmetrical. Uh, for any deviations that you might have, okay? And now we're gonna be checking your cranial nerve number 11, which would be the spinal sensor. I'm gonna put my hands here, and I'm gonna have you lift your shoulders up, and I'm gonna put pressure down, okay? Go up, and perfect, okay? That would be cranial nerve number 11. Cranial nerve number 12 is a hypoglossal nerve, which is a tongue movement. Go ahead and stick it out, straight ahead, down, up, perfect, and I'm checking for any deformations that you might have or any deviations that you might have, the tongue might be moving. And those are the 12 cranial nerves that we have. Okay, can, part of your assessment that we're gonna do, I'm gonna ask you a few questions. Can you tell me your name? Yeah. Okay, can you tell me where you're at today? A doctor's office. Okay, can you tell me what day today is? July 24th. Okay, and the time? 7.30. Okay, perfect. Now we're gonna check your sensory, which is part of the sensory system of the cranial nerves. Um, I'm gonna give you some objects, I'm gonna have you close your eyes, and I'm gonna have you feel for them and you're gonna tell me what they are, okay? okay? Go ahead and feel it. Can you tell me what it is? A uh, paper slip. Perfect, okay, give me your other hand. A coin. Perfect, okay, give me another hand, your other hand. A ring. Perfect, and that's part of the sensory system. Now I'm going to check a little bit more of the motor cerebral, cerebral system, okay, which is the posture, which you're erect, and your coordination. So, and also what I'm going to do right now, part of the sensory and coordination, I'm going to put a tube and you're going to tell me what you feel, okay? Cold. Perfect. Hot. Perfect, perfect. Okay, and I'm going to also do again the little sense of the touch and so that you can distinguish with, but close your eyes and you're gonna tell me, okay? okay. My cheek, my forehead, my cheek, my arm, my arm, my finger, my other finger. Perfect, okay Mia, now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna check your reflexes, okay. and okay, I'm gonna start from the top to the bottom, okay? Your reflex there, and your elbow, your tricep, your wrist, 
the knee and I'm gonna go down to your Achilles and I'm gonna take your shoe off real quick because I'm gonna do the bottom. Okay, and that's it. Okay, okay, Mia, what we're gonna do now, part of your assessment, I'm gonna be checking your, your joints, so I'm gonna have you step down, okay? And what I'm gonna have you do is go ahead and face that way. I'm gonna check your spine, okay? Your spine, your spine, go ahead and look up straight. I'm gonna check your posture if you're erect. I'm gonna go ahead and um, have you extend your arms out. And one at a time, I'm gonna up and down for each one. Up and down, and then the next one, up and down. Okay, up, all the way up, above your head and down. All the way down to your, there we go, and then to the top, and all the way down. Okay, I'm gonna have you extend them forward for me, and you're gonna go ahead and, and move up and down, side to side. You're gonna go ahead and move your wrist. Do they bother you at any point? No. Okay, I'm checking for the flexibility of your joints, okay, and see if there's any crepitus or any noise that we might hear. Go ahead and put them down. Okay, I'm gonna have you squat all the way down, please. Squat, do they bother you? No. Your knees, your legs, your ankles? No. Okay, go ahead and stand up. And I'm gonna have you touch your toes for me. Don't bend your knees. Put your head between your knees, and I'm gonna check your back. And we're checking your spine for any scoliosis, lordosis, or any abnormalities that we may find. Go ahead and stand up straight. Okay, now what I'm gonna have you do now is I'm gonna have you stand on one foot and go ahead and your, I'm checking your balance at one time. Does it bother you? No. Okay, now go ahead and do it the other side. Perfect. Okay. Can you move one leg out and the other? Perfect. Can you do it forward and back? The same leg back and then the other one. Perfect. Now I'm going to have you walk on your heels forward. Back. Perfect. Now, can you walk on your two toes forward and back for me? And back. Perfect. Now, can you walk like if you're walking on a line, like a straight line for me? Perfect. Now back. As I'm doing this, I'm checking for balance also. Okay? Alrighty, I'm going to have you go ahead and step up. Back and back. And I'm just going to check your or any any diff inflammation that you might have. Okay, and we're done with your assessment. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, we're the one last part before we finish. I'm gonna just check your the toes, the joints in your toes. Okay. okay. For any movement, I mean, for any abnormalities or any inflammation on your joints. Do they bother you? No. Okay, one more last thing. I'm gonna check for the flexion extension for each toe one at a time. Okay. Okay, okay now on this side, flex, up, down. They don't bother you? No. Perfect, okay. We're going ahead and we're done with our assessment, okay? Okay, thank you. Thank you.